You might think that the crowning achievement for any race would be global peace, or perhaps knowledge of everything in this world. We had both. We achieved the former first, and it granted us pride beyond compare. It allowed us to seek out the latter, knowledge. Something we should not have sought had we wished to remain blissful. We were always afraid of the unknown, though, so it was inevitable. Because of that fear, we desired to know everything. And we succeeded. We desired to share our success with other worlds, or at least attempt to do so. What good is having everything when you have no one with whom to share? It would be a shame were that the case. For the next few generations, we set out to explore the known universe for signs of intelligent, civilized life. When our efforts proved fruitless, we decided to settle for any kind of life form. This too provided us with nothing to show for all our efforts. It made no sense. With a universe as seemingly infinite as ours, it would be ludicrous, no, insane, to assume that we were the only beings in existence, past or present. It didn't make any sense. With this realization came many emotions. Despair, anger, and depression, to name a few. We had reached our peak as a civilization, and we felt lonely, for lack of a better term. Some of us just ended our own lives. Some of us decided to just aimlessly explore space and never return. And some of us sought to turn inward to explore our spirituality. A silly notion, maybe, but I am thankful for that last group. What they practiced was not really fit to be called a religion, although we would have been hard-pressed to differentiate it. They sought enlightenment and the ability to transcend mortal desires. Oh, nonsense, yes. But they found something. We didn't know what it was they found at first, though. None of us did. Soon enough, we realized that perhaps there existed other universes, and that the ability to detect and interact with them lay not in our technological prowess, but in our own state of consciousness. It dawned on us that there must exist beings, maybe entire races like ours, who are also alone in their worlds, completely unaware of our existence. We desired to make contact. For the next few centuries, we all, as a race, worked towards making that dream a reality. And now, we believe we hold the ability to do it. The device we have constructed to aid us in the global effort represents the highest achievement in our logical, science-based reasoning. Some may have considered our countless years of scientific advances in order to explore space in search of other races to have been a waste of time, but I do not believe that to be the case at all. I believe that both parts of our minds, both the logical and the spiritual, needed to be trained to their utmost limits in order to now achieve what we want. We want to not be alone. It's almost time now. Our race has chosen me to activate the machine. All I need to do is press a button. Everyone is waiting on me now to press the button, but I feel I must write my thoughts down a bit more. What will it be like to venture into other worlds and attract the attention of things outside our realm of perception? Is it their attention we want? Ah. Too soon, I'm sorry to say. Too soon. Where are we? You are at the ending. You who have achieved so much. In your pursuit of knowledge, you have conquered the universe. You have made it yours. Would you like to know its final secret? I do not think so, but... Do you doubt our conviction? Throughout our existence, we have been continually striving for this moment. Yes, I know. You would not be here if you had faltered along the way. Are you sure, though? You will regret knowing. The truth is not worth the price you have paid and the price that has yet to come. There is no going back for us. We have come too far to retreat. Fine, then. I will tell you. You, who have achieved everything but far too soon. Your price to pay for my knowledge is this. I shall eradicate every one of you. Out of kindness. And sadness. Are you mad? 
You believe we have toiled for countless generations for... For that? Our total erasure? I am neither angry nor insane. Do not be foolish. Your extinction is merely the price you shall pay for the knowledge you desire, which I shall grant to you now. Are you ready? A silly question. I know you aren't. I can feel the fear creeping upon you. The very kind that has driven your race to find me. I will miss you all. Maybe I will think about you later. At a later time. At a later day. Or maybe I won't. Maybe it will be better to forget. We'll see. I'll see. Goodbye, all of you. I loved you each with my all, but you were just too impatient. This is no one's fault but my own. I am sorry. I don't hate any of you. I'll try harder next time. It will be better next time.